Por la tasca. Por la tasca. Vandaag is de voortzetting van de Medical Dentist Redis Training Exercise. Het is een samenwerking tussen het Amerikaans leger, ondersteund door het Nationaal Leger Suriname, de medische zending en ook ondersteund door jeugd en verzorging. Dit is jullie laatste locatie? Het is onze laatste locatie. De vorige locaties zijn gestart te Achoni. Vervolgens hebben we ons verplaatst te Bronsweg. En nu zijn we hier. Er zijn wel veel mensen. Er zijn ontzettend veel mensen. Uh, tot gisteren hebben we 1121 mensen gezien. Ben je er En dan hebben we Major Benjamin Abbey. Hij heeft de operatie So. At Adjoni in Braunschweig, we've been able to treat over 1,100 patients so far. And we've also had about almost, almost 400 patients for dental. And we've done a lot of dental care. And through there, a lot of the teeth cannot be restored, so we have to do a lot of extractions for the patients. And we've had almost 771 extractions so far for the patients. And that number will probably continue to climb. The klachten zijn variërend. Um, je hebt mensen met chronische aandoeningen, uh, hoge bloeddruk, suikerziekte. Um, je hebt mensen met rugklachten. We, we've done a lot of symptomatic treatments, so like common symptoms, like they have heartburn based off the, some of the food that they have. A lot of the people in the interior are very hardworking people, and so they had, have a lot of uh, musculoskeletal or just shoulder pain, back pains, uh, a lot of chronic issues, just overuse issues, just because they're hardworking and they're sore by the end of the days. Um, sometimes we have a lot of uh, ear or we have a lot of um, different skin conditions, hair conditions, fungal conditions. Um, based on just the weather, humidity, and, and everything else that kind of gets into it. So those are, those are some of the common symptoms that we've seen. You can, you can tell kind of the trust factor because they wait all day for us too. They want to be seen and, and they and want to be taken care of. So I, I think that builds trust in through there and good results from that um, just builds even more trust. And we've been, um, our partnership has been with Suriname since tw 2006. I think this is our 16th year of a partnership. So I, I think that builds a trust and when they start seeing um, our South Dakota patch, I don't have my normal uniform on, but when they see our South Dakota patch, they kind of understand that this is the same people that come and have been coming for quite a few years. It won't hurt. It just beeps. That's all. The medical mission is also a training, say you? Yeah, the medical mission is also a training. Why? Because we learn from the American and even so we learn from us. Het is een vorm van uh, kennisuitwisseling. En hoe gaat dat? Het is namelijk zo dus dat uh, de Amerikanen met een team van uh, artsen en specialisten komen. Um, wij komen in met uh, logistiek, met uh, medisch personeel, met beveiliging. Um, en zo wordt het geheel ondersteund. Onze mensen die helpen mee, niet alleen bij de vertaling, maar ook waar nodig een bepaalde insteek moeten geven, dan uh, doen wij dat. We're very happy uh, to be able to get back into doing uh, medical access and dental uh, care provisions uh, in cooperation with the South Dakota National Guard again. Uh, it's been since before COVID, Correct. Uh, the last time, and um, yeah, it, it's taken a little while, but uh, I think you can see by the, the numbers of people outside that it's very well received. <laughs> we, we've kind of I'm refined so impressed a by the number of people they are sitting mm -hmm. very patiently for all. Oh, and they, they wait all day long too. Yeah, it's and, amazing. And what this mission vandaag ook leert is that there is an enorme behoefte is aan medische zorg. 
En je ziet dat mensen uren moeten reizen om toegang te hebben tot medische zorg. En dat is iets wat we moeten meenemen en bespreken en beleid opmaken. We hebben op dit moment heel weinig toegang tot medische zorg. Vooral tandartsen, oogheelkunde, apotheek. We hebben niet, niet, geen apotheek hier. Dus het is heel belangrijk dat we dit meenemen. Met Zoudakoot hebben we een heel lange relatie. We leren ook van hun, zij leren ook van ons. Dat is ook de geest van deze relatie. En tegelijkertijd bieden we de helpende hand aan de samenleving. Dat is ook wat wij aan het doen zijn. The second day we had a lot more people. The third day we have even more people. And now, I mean, it's every single day that we've been here, it's been more and more and more and more. And you see, actually, a number of people, more than 1100, who to now have here been here, at Achoni and Bronsberg and now Brokopondo, that the need is very high. That people look out for medical care. So I'm going to take this to the government. So we are very happy with... De, de gasten, de Amerikanen, want we gaan niet onder stoelen en banken schuiven. We willen weten dat de overheid, de effectiviteit van de overheid niet is of nog niet is wat het wezen moet. Maar we gaan niet staan wachten en we gaan de helpende hand blijven bieden.